Welcome back to Hibla Filipiniana, Shuttles of Unity, Threads of Identity, Series Part 3, with From Ancient Trade Routes of the South, as we explore our traditions of the Muslim communities of Mindanao. Traditional decorative arts of Muslim communities in the southernmost islands of the Philippines, Mindanao, use a variety of design motifs and symbols influenced by the long presence of Hinduism, Buddhism, and Islam. The artistic development in this region can be attributed to Malay ancestors who possessed well-developed art and culture. Although interpretations of design vary considerably between individual artists, native artists operate within the aesthetic and stylistic limits of their local society. Traditional decorative designs alone do not denote wealth or status. These may be used, however, on many wealth items for personal purposes like garments, jewelry, and weaponry. These are customarily exchanged in ceremonies or displayed as a badge of status during other important occasions. Rendering of design motifs can be realistic, stylized, or abstract. The result is never simple or minimal in expression, both in form and content or meaning. Ukil or okir are undoubtedly the most important to the Maranao, Maguindanawon, Iranun, Tausug, Sama, and Bajau of Mindanao. To these ethnic communities, the term ukil or okir means both the art of sculpting or carving and a particular curvilinear design. Internationally, this design is recognized as arabesque. It is a decorative visual language of natural and flowing forms with its own grammar and vocabulary. As far as the natives are concerned, art is ukil. Ukil motifs, whether carved, painted, patched, embroidered, etched, cut out, or cast, it decorates every conceivable object, weapons, tools, household utensils and furnishings, grave markers, musical instruments, wall paneling and matting, food covers, canopies, bedsheets, and jewelry. The lotus flower is prominent in the vocabulary of motifs of the Taosug in the Sulu archipelago. The Taosug term for lotus flower is kayapu. Lukis kayapu is a motif combining the lotus blossom with other leaves and blossoms. Following the principles of traditional art, these forms flow from a central motif represented by the lotus flower. In Malay tradition, this flowing out from a center outward is known as the spiral of life or awan larat. The designs itself has its roots in the Hindu Buddhist tradition and is invested with profound meaning and symbolism representing the unending process of creation, regeneration, degeneration, and reunification back to the central point of origin of the cosmos. The art of Muslim Mindanao is filled with sacred symbolism and meaning. Their principal objective being to reflect Tawhid, or the consciousness of divine unity. The dances of the Muslim communities of Mindanao are touched by the influences of Hindu, Javanese, Chinese, and Arab Persian civilizations exchanged during early Southeast Asian trade routes. The emphasis on the upper torso and the use of the hands to express nuances of feeling, 
bent knees and upturned toes are combined in different degrees of intensity depending on the mood and individual expression of the dancer.